means we live healthy one story at a time. Ruth? Hi! I'm the one being interviewed. <laughs> My baby, my yeah. baby. Amazing. Cooing and other vocalizations uh -huh. may replace eh? May replace what? A clying. <laughs> ah, clying. Baby, continue okay. clying. Early treats that she takes after daddy. Kai, 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 kai. Izo, Izo, Izo Ziko Ming. Tell us a bit about her. Ni funguli, eh? Things that mother should 50. Hello there and welcome to Kaleke's Health Moments where as always we live healthy one story at a time. Um, before we start the health trivia, can you please tell us a bit about Baby Talua? Oh, Baby Talua! Huh? Well, her name is Raina okay. Talua. Okay. Yes, and um, mm. Reina means uh, the song of the Lord, mm -hmm. or also means uh, queen. Mm -hmm. And then Tolua is a Yoruba name meaning belonging to God. Okay. Yeah, so she's yes. oh. one who belongs to God. Yeah. yeah. Uh, wow, Aki, that child has just brought so much joy in my life. I really thank God for her every, every single day. She's. She's a she's a calm baby, by the way, mm -hmm. in terms of uh, you know she doesn't decide when she cries, then either she's hungry mm -hmm. or just s sleepy. Mm -hmm. Other than that, Tolua is a happy child. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's so nice. <laughs> Treats you think she's taking on after her her daddy? Wow, I think there are some that I'm seeing, especially as she continues to grow. Um, what I can now which ones? There's so many, but um, first of all, I think just being calm. She's not as calm, but I, I know between <laughs> the father and myself. He was more calm than I was uh, than I am. So um, she's a bit calm, uh, jumpy, jumpy once in a while, and then uh, her eyebrows and lashes are the fathers. Like they're just long. You'd think at a, you you'd think I you know like I shaped them or anything. N nothing, nothing, nothing. That she has great eyebrows and lashes like the la like the dad. And uh, what else? I don't know, just so many things that I keep seeing here and there, here and there. Yeah. yeah. The way your eyes are sparkling oh, when you're talking. My God, I love it. <laughs> now we'll play oh. a very simple health quiz, eh? Mm -hmm. And as we are playing it, yeah. other people can also get to learn. Some people might not know some yeah. of these things, yeah. Mm -hmm. Like true or false, mm -hmm. is it okay for pregnant women to exercise? True. Yes, it is true. However, the doctors say while pregnancy can get a little worrisome, many people worry about harming the baby if they are to do something strenuous. Okay, question number two. Babies usually laugh within the first four to six A weeks or B months. Four to six months. Laugh no. Four to six months. Okay. Month. Four to six months. The correct answer is months. Yeah. Social behaviors such as smiling begin at as early as six weeks, mm. but laughing out loud usually happens yeah. within three to six months. Sometimes babies laugh when they see mom or dad mm. or their favorite toy, but many babies laugh just because it's fun and it feels good. Wow. Third uh -huh. question. Mm -hmm. At two months, new moms should dash the baby. Talk to the, ba the baby. B play with the baby two months yes whether you should play or talk. or talk with the baby play talk play talk two months you talk to the baby the correct answer is talk to uh -huh. hey, 
I'm doing well. You're yeah, yeah. making these answers. I'm I know. <laughs> I'm thinking of what I used to do with my child okay. when they were at that age. Okay. Oh man. Actually, the correct answer is talk, talk to, to the baby. Wow. Parents should play with their babies anytime. Uh -huh. But once a child reaches two months, yeah. talking to them is important as it starts the language learning process. Wow. Babies respond to the sounds of their parents' voices and talking to them will encourage them to talk back. Oh, amazing. So you are correct. Mm -hmm. Three. Yeah. Yay. Question four. Uh -huh. Changes in baby's poop color should be a cause of concern. True or false? True. The correct answer is false. Oh. <laughs> I thought they were asking if it's true that they, you know, the poop changes color. It's like they're answering you, relax. Baby poop changes color uh -huh. and it's a constant concern for parents. Yeah. But for the most part, uh, it, it shouldn't be. be. Then they'll help me because me when it changes, I'm you're, like, okay, like, something is wrong. Okay. Uh -huh. Question five. Mm -hmm. The term hatching refers to babies, A, first experience handling toys, mm -hmm. or B, awareness and involvement in the world around them. Pass. I've never heard of it. So they explain that much like a baby bird hatches mm -hmm. and comes into the world, okay. at about three months, your baby will hatch mm -hmm. and come out of his shell. Oh. This is when babies start to communicate and interact with their surroundings. Amazing. Cooing and other vocalizations may replace crying okay. and babies will start to laugh. Question oh. number six. Uh -huh. The maximum amount of crying for a three-month-old baby is about mm -hmm. A, an hour a day, mm -hmm. B, two hours a day, mm -hmm. C, three hours a day, and D, four hours a day. Put together, mm. of course not at the one hour continuous, if you put them together, oh, I'm not so sure, mine was sleeping, all, three months, yeah? Mm. Mine was sleeping almost all through. Mm. At three months, eight. Hey, at three months is crazy. Four. four I'll go for the four one hours four a hours day. a day. Okay. <laughs> an hour. The correct <laughs> answer is an hour a day. <laughs> a three-month-old babies or oh, three-month-old babies only cry about an hour each day. Mm -hmm. Crying is replaced by more cooing and okay, bubbling okay, okay. and other vocalizations as your baby tries to interact with his surroundings oh. and communicate. Okay. If your baby cries more than about an hour, uh -huh. see a doctor to find out if it is an underlying cause. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, for even mm. for me, if I find like it's too, uh, an hour is too late. Yeah. I, yeah. Those, those, those children can cry uh, one. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, question number seven. seven. Uh -huh. Babies tend to double their birth weight by their fourth month of life. True or false? To double their birth weight. Yeah, at, by, at by their fourth month of life. Mm. Okay, I think it really depends. That would be putting pressure on milestones for kids. But mm. I would say false. Mine doubled at the second month. The correct That's answer true. is true. Yeah. By the time your baby is four months old, her weight will have doubled from her birth weight. Tell your child's pediatrician if your child isn't gaining weight or eating enough. Mm. I think uh, we are going towards the end now, mm -hmm. number eight. Mm -hmm. It's time to start child proofing when baby is A, born, B, four months old. I, four months old. Four months old. Eh? <laughs> yeah, the correct answer is four months old. Yeah. Child proofing should ideally start while you're expecting. Mm. There is a lot to do. Once your baby reaches four months old, they start getting into everything and child proofing becomes a necessity. Mm. Install child proof locks on cabinets, store all cleaning products and other dangerous items such as medicines, mm -hmm. knives and even small items the child can choke on mm. out of reach. Cover unused outlets, installed window, install window guards mm. and put up gates across stairways. Mm. Get on your hands and the knees and see how the home looks from the baby's perspective so you can scoop you can scope out anything that needs to be secure. Uh -huh. Yeah, at least I've learned something. Yeah. And, yeah. So, number nine, number the nine. best way to get baby to sleep is to uh -huh. A, put baby to bed after eating, uh -huh. B, put baby down when she is drowsy, uh -huh. C, play with the baby until she's tired, <laughs> D, all of the above. Eh? So, number one was? Put baby to bed after eating. After eating, yes. Uh -huh. 
put baby down when she's drowsy. Uh huh. Play with baby until she's tired. Mm -hmm. I'll go with that one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Tire them out. Then uh. D all of their bar. I would go for B uh -huh. the right way. Mm. The right way would be to put them yeah, when, yeah, uh, when they are drowsy. Okay. But imagine all of them work. Okay, yeah. <laughs> this was work for my baby. The, but your, the, the right one is, is when they are drowsy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Put your baby, the correct answer is what Ruth has said. Uh -huh. Put your baby into her crib when she's awake but drowsy. Yeah. And not yet fully asleep. Not, yeah, yeah. So she can learn to soothe herself to sleep. Mm. This way, if baby wakes up in the middle of the night but does not need anything, he or she will probably cry if they do. He can get himself back to sleep without waking you. So this one worked very well for my child. Okay. I, I once checked it out because okay. I was like, I when can I put them to sleep and all that? Mm. Okay. Yeah. And then question number 10 and the final question. Uh -huh. I have to get in then we'll check the score. Hey, Until at least age one, mom should avoid feeding baby mm -hmm. A, cow's milk, mm -hmm. B, honey, C, peas, D, A, and B only. What you should avoid feeding the baby? Yes. Until age one? Yes. A. A. Cow's, cow's, milk. cow's milk. Yeah. Cow's milk. Yeah. Eh? Uh, A, yeah? yeah? Let's see. The correct answer is A and B. Oh, okay. So you've gotten so one of the I'm, answers I, correct. B was what? B was, um, let's see. B was, uh, okay. Those cow's milk. And P, there was peas. Okay, those peas. Uh, honey. Yeah, cow's milk and honey. Peas, honey, honey and, and then A and, and B. B. Okay, okay, yeah. yeah. I remember it was Nini yeah, Honey. Yeah, yeah. Also honey should yeah. be until one year. Yeah. Mm. So there's there's a time somebody advised me to give my baby um honey. Uh -huh. The so uh -huh. And I was told never. Yeah. You know, you know when you give birth, everybody wants to advise oh, you. They have all and, the solutions. And even I had women who were like getting into arguments because of you know do this do ah, this you know the, and I, if you I, listen they to that well, one but I know. yeah yeah they can also mislead it's uh, best to get advice from a medical you mm, know yeah yeah uh. so a and b only okay babies should not consume honey oh, until at honey. least age one uh -huh. because it carries the bacteria that causes botulism uh -huh. i don't know what that is yeah, we'll check cow's it. milk should also be avoided for the first year because babies can't digest it uh -huh. like they the can formula, formula. Mm. in addition the high levels of protein and minerals are taxing to For a young, young baby's kidneys. kidneys. Oh, yes, yes. yes. Wow. So, wow. oh, there's 11, but we, 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 we stop there. One more, one more, we one more. We continue. Eh? Eh. Okay, 11. Uh -huh. Separation anxiety usually appears in babies at about A, three months, B, four months, C, six months, or D, seven months. That is, uh, I want to understand what it is first. Separ the, the one when they, when they, when they are like they notice, from ma yeah, that yeah. mom has gone. Yeah, and they become like you know, upset yeah. or something. Yeah. Uh, so they're saying three, uh, three months, four, six, six and, and seven. seven. Yeah. yeah, I would say six. Six months. Yeah, eh? following my child. Mm. So it's seven months old. Though at seven months it became worse. Okay, okay. yeah, they're yeah. right. Yeah, they're yeah, right. yeah. So yeah. I also think the, 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 it's uh, it's not one size fits all. Eh? Yeah. Maybe eh. they've just done an uh, eh. approximate. Yeah? Mine started at six kidogo, but at seven, okay. oh, it was crazy. Okay. Mm. Starting at about seven months, mm. babies start to show separation anxiety. This is when babies start to understand that people and things exist when they are not in front of them like uh, called object permanence oh. then separation anxiety can peak at about 10 to 12 months and finally tapers off by about two years so you started so at six for it. and it peaked it was peak it peaked at seven months uh, uh, and, at seven it was and worse. By the, now it's, it's still, now it's worse okay she's nine so it's still uh, going according to yeah, this uh, yeah 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 okay so wow. check your quiz results uh-huh let's see you got six out of eleven correct. Oh, I don't you scored me. a fifty-five percent. No. But an average user score is fifty-nine percent. So you 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 are close. 
most of them I'm not even that. at average. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You just fall to the average. Yeah. Yeah. So mm. thanks so much. Ruth. Thank you for having me. Yeah, uh, it's been a pleasure. Mm -hmm. Thank you for sharing your story, and I hope it's going to be an inspiration. Oh yeah. To others. Mm. Yes. Thank you for having me. Yes. We can do this again another time. Okay. So, so yeah. Yeah.